Emma Woodhouse was born with the sun shining. Emma was not to remember. 너무 일찍 엄마를 잃은 엠마. 아빠의 과잉 보호를 받아야 했고 한편 비슷한 처지의 노인 프랭크는 I will take the child, Mr. Weston, for the sake of my foolishness. He will live with me always, and his name will be Frank Churchill. 마지막으로 이모 베이트 양과 함께 지냈지만 풍족하지 못했던 제인. Captain Campbell is very well set up. He will give her the education we can. Were forced to leave Highbury and trust their fortune to strangers. 그렇게 7년의 시간이 흘렀지만. 오늘도 조카 자랑은 계속되고 있었죠. Eight accomplishments between one and the next. And Miss Bates seems to come here every week to tell us about them. <웃음> There are John and Isabella again. They are impossible. She makes sell at words and music, but uh, but people. There, I am the expert. Really? My sister and your brother. 두 사람의 결혼을 예언하지만 나이트이 씨는 말도 안 된다 생각했고. I, Isabella Woodhouse. Take thee, John Knightley. 결혼을 하게 되죠. Lucky guess. Just talent and intuition. 신이 난 엠마의 눈에 들어온 다음 타겟은 바로 프랭크의 아버지 웨스터 씨 그리고 자신의 가정교사인 테일러. I'm sure there's room under the large one for both of you. I knew from that day with the umbrellas that he would marry Miss Taylor. It is my greatest success. Stay away from the cake. 그렇게 두 사람도 결혼을 하게 되죠. I'm so sorry that Frank was not able to come after all. His aunt could not spare him. She's so very ill. 애네 결혼은 축하할 일이었지만 그만큼 아쉬움도 컸고. <웃음> no more matchmaking. This house cannot stand another departure. A ghost house. I wonder you'll be able to sleep at night. 이런 공허함을 이제는 사돈이 된 나이틀리 씨가 종종 채워주곤 했죠. 이제는 함께 산책할 사람도 없었고 I'm sure you'll find another companion. Who is that young woman? That is Harriet Smith, one of our most popular boarders. 예쁘장한 외모. 그녀가 궁금해지기 시작하는데. Oh, she's the uh, natural daughter of but they're 그녀의 부모를 알수 없었지만 수년간 학비를 지원하고 있다는 말에 분명 귀족 집안일 거라 생각한 엠마 저녁 식사 초대를 하게 되고 손꼽아 기다리던 화요일 저녁 뒤늦게 이 마을 목사 엘턴이 도착하죠 On the errand of one whose business I hold only just in higher regard than yours On whose business? The Almighty's. God's. Mm. Yes. I don't know what you think of this new intimacy between Emma and Harriet Smith, but I think it could be a bad. I have heard Emma say a dozen times she will never marry. 아버지를 절대 혼자 두지 않겠다는 다짐과 막대한 유산, 당연히 결혼은 뒷전으로 밀려버렸고 엠마 특유의 허영심이. 그녀에게 전염될까 걱정스러웠던 거죠. Good morning, Miss Smith. Good morning, Mr. Martin. Harriet, who was that young man? Oh, that was my Mr. Martin. 지난 여름에 함께 보낸 농부라는 사실에. Martin, I'm very much of a farmer, but I had no notion he would be so very clownish. 격에 맞지 않는 남자와 어울리는 것 같아 속상한 엠마. 그리고 때마침 베이트 양의 조카 자랑질까지. We will come and listen tomorrow on our usual visit. Oh well, good then. <laughs> of the very name Jane Fairfax, Frank is like a lost boy never to return home. Not even for his father's wedding. Let us think of superior men. There are plenty of more suitable suitors around. <웃음> 한동안 잠잠했던 중매 본능에 불을 붙인 건 다름 아닌 엘턴과 해리엣. Do you not think what an excellent subject the human form would be? Deed, a depiction by. Your affair and Miss Smith. That. What did I tell you? I knew there would be suitors soon enough. You will be married by the New Year. <웃음> 한편 같은 시간. Robert Martin. Is that you? No. 
know, Miss Smith, you must keep your bows. 그녀의 가스라이팅 덕분일까 본격적으로 사랑에 빠져들기 시작했고. Are you sure you wouldn't be more sensible to consider this development in a few years? I see no reason to delay something I've set my mind on. Good luck, Robert. Thank you, sir. 그리고 며칠 후. Miss Woodhouse, Miss Woodhouse! It is a proposal from Robert Martin. Well, at least I thought it was when I read it. Well, what should I do? What should you do? What do you mean? I'm sure you can manage. You must be very clear and properly conscious of the pain you... So you think I ought to refuse him, then? Pardon me. I imagined you asked me merely to advise you as to the phrasing. 얼떨결에 반대의 뜻을 내비쳤고 본격 가스라이팅 심화 과정이 시작되죠. If a woman doubts whether to accept a man or not, she really ought to refuse him. 약 3초의 고민 끝에 Refuse? Mr. Martin? Perfectly! <웃음> Perfectly right! Oh. 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 oh, thank goodness I am in no danger of losing your company forever. I would not give up the pleasure of your friendship for anything in the world. <웃음> What artistry. We must get it properly framed. We'll get them to take it to London, have it framed for you. But that may be some weeks away. I could ride to town and back in a day on such a... a precious errand. 한편 비장함을 안고 하이버리를 찾은 나이트이 나름의 이유가 있었는데 Mr. Robert Martin is desperately in love with your Miss Smith. He came to speak to me about it and despite my doubts about the match, I gave my blessing. Um, Mr. Martin did speak yesterday, well, that is, he wrote, and he was refused. Refused Robert Martin? It's madness. Harriet Smith is the natural daughter of nobody knows whom. She's not a sensible girl and has been taught nothing useful. I even thought of you. I thought even Emma will think that this is a good match. Farmer, a good match for my intimate friend. It would be a degradation. There can scarcely be any doubt that her father was a gentleman and a gentleman of fortune. 서로의 지인이 더 낫다는 말다툼이 계속되던 그때 엘턴이 찾아오고 Thank you so much, Mr. Elton. Harriet will be so very grateful. That man is so full of himself, I'm surprised he can stay on that horse. I will just hint to you that if Elton is the chosen man, Elton will not do. I've heard him speak with great animation of a large family of young ladies who all have 20,000 apiece. Harriet and Robert are not your playthings, your dolls. To be told what to do and to marry under the table at your bidding, they're flesh and blood. 매일 밟고 당찼던 엠마 적지 않은 충격을 받게 되고 Oh, it is a riddle. 미모와 순수함을 타고났지만 총명함을 받지 못했고. I can't decipher. Perhaps court? And the, the monarch of the seas. Maybe a ship. Ship court. Is that it? Uh, try again. No. Courtship. <웃음> I hope to see you settled in the vicarage by the spring. <웃음> Father, why do you not wait inside? They said they would set out with plenty of time. Ah. 시집간 언니 이자벨란의 식구가 도착. I assure you, I did the chores tonight. Really good. I have the salt. I have to go to the. 남이 아닌 사돈 지간 언제까지나 이렇게 지낼 순 없었죠. I was your considerable superior in years when you were the age of little Emma here. Come, let's be friends. Hmm? And we'll say no more about it. <웃음> Oh dear. You may not be able to go to the Weston's dinner party, but we can still make this a good test of Mr. Elton's regard. I will not wish to go, Mr. Elton, as Harriet is so very ill. I am very much looking forward to it. John의 배려로 마차를 얻었다고. How very cozy we all are. Ah, ah, careful there. Miss Woodhouse's cloak must not be crushed. Miss Woodhouse. 엘턴의 기대와는 달리 
그녀의 관심은 오랫동안 보지 못한 프랭크 처칠에 쏠려 있었죠. So I've waited eagerly to meet him for nearly 20 years. A few more weeks will not be too difficult to bear. Six cents whenever he gives his attention to anyone else but her and calls his conscience home again. She keeps him like a dog on a lead. 이때 갑작스런 폭설이 시작되고 눈이 더 쌓이기 전 파티를 끝내야 했는데요. 엘턴의 눈빛을 읽은 존의 배려로 또다시 합석을 하게 되고 Make me the happiest man in the world. I adore you. I remind you of your attachment to Miss Smith. What are you talking about? For herself. I can't care less if she lives or dies. <웃음> 그동안의 모든 행동은 엠마를 위한 것이다 고백하지만 그녀는 손절하죠. You never preferred Miss Smith. Never, madam. But I think that I do not have to stoop to her. This is your fault, Emma. Was he really admiring my talent rather than Harriet's form? How could I have been so stupid? How am I going to tell Harriet? What's the matter? Is someone ill? It is only natural that that it should have been you, Miss Woodhouse. It could cease it of me to to raise my sights to him. 진심을 다해 사과한 덕분일까? 오히려 관계는 더욱 돈독해질 수 있었지만 분위기 전환을 위해 찾은 베이트 양의 집에는 둘 사이에 회포를 풀기 도전 또다시 수다가 시작 캠벨 대령의 예비사위 빅슨 씨와의 에피소드까지 이야기해버리는데 Mr. Dixon saved her life. Friends, when Jane slipped on a stone, and Mr. Dixon stepped in and saved her from almost certain death. I wonder why the wonderful Miss Fairfax should be so reluctant to acknowledge Mr. Dixon. 분명 둘 사이에 무언가 있다 생각한 그때. You seem lost, sir. I'm not lost. Thank you for your trouble. All the same. 의문의 사나이의 등장 그리고. Have you heard the news? Mr. Eldon is to be married. He has been in Bath these four weeks only, and he is engaged. 역시 눈치가 없는 건이 마을 최고였고. Her name is Miss Augusta Hawkins, and she is worth twenty thousand pounds. 한편 좋은 소식도 있었죠. Frank is coming home tomorrow. Are you sure? Now I present my son, Mr. Frank Churchill. Many times set off determined to visit my father, but on the way my my conscience forced my return to my aunt. I was saying to your father, what a good pair you make. I told Frank you would be his guide to hide. Many times. 하지만 그 전에 만나봐야 할 사람이 있다는 프랭크. 그건 다름 아닌 베이티앙. Well, I I met her niece, Jane Fairfax, in Weymouth. Weymouth. 주체할 수 없는 호기심이 발동하고. You are save Jane Fairfax's life. Oh, ah, yes, yes, it was the door. I meant to stay for only ten minutes, but the good lady kept on talking. 한편 하이버리엔 새로운 가십거리로 떠들썩했고. But the most enormous pianoforte addressed to Jane Fairfax. Jane was quite at a loss as to who might have sent her this magnificent gift. 모두들 캠벨 대령이 보냈을 거라 추측하지만 두 사람의 생각은 달랐는데. I seem to remember Mr. Dixon thought Miss Fairfax unsurpassed in the piano. Poor Miss Campbell, always having one's particular friend at hand to do everything so much better than oneself. Jane을 좋아하지 않는 엠마는 일면식도 없는 캠벨 양에게 감정 이입을 하게 됩니다. 그리고 또 다른 뉴스가 있었는데. Can you guess how Miss Bates and Jane Fairfax arrived here today? Thanked me, but said that Mr. Knightley had sent his carriage to fetch them and would take them home. That is just what he would do. He never said a word to me. That our Mr. Knightley might just have turned his mind to matrimony. Mr. Knightley will never marry. Imagine Miss Bates at Donwell, haunting the place. 나아가 피아노도 나이틀리 씨가 보냈을 거라 추측하는데요. 그럼에도 제인이 마냥 싫은 엠마는 현실 부정을 시전하죠. I do not believe that Mr. Knightley is the mysterious present giver. It is not in his nature to be secretive. I think Jane would make a very good mistress of Donwell. 
Anyhow, my career in matchmaking, such as it was, is over. I've been here in Highbury two weeks. Yet I feel I've always lived here. Frank는 슬슬 지루함을 느끼기 시작했는데. What do you propose? A ball, Miss Woodhouse. What say you to a ball? I am fairly sure that that is one talent in which I am the equal of Jane Fairfax. Come on, let's test the floor space. 이번에야말로 본때를 보여줄 수 있을 거란 기대는. For a ball. A ball. A ball. Oh, I hope nothing will prevent it. I am so looking forward to it. <웃음> 그렇지만 나이트 씨는 통 관심이 없었죠. Are you saying you are not coming? Oh, I will accept Mr. Weston's kind invitation when it arrives. But I will not dance. I do not enjoy dancing and I'm not good at it. His aunt is extremely ill. He has said he is not leaving without seeing you. What can he have to say? To me alone. How should one look? If one were supposed to be in love in return, how does it feel to be in love? 나라 이름 표정의 프랭크. I don't know when I might return, but it will be the only thing I think about. 깜빡이도 없이 훅 치고 들어왔지만 다행히 정신줄을 놓지 않았고. You will come back. Well, my my regard for. Feeling that everything around the house is dull and insipid. It can only mean one thing. I must be in love. <목소리> 한편 엘턴이 아내와 함께 돌아오자 여러 부작용이 속출하기 시작했고. Oh, and who do you think we met while we were at Randall's? Knightley. Nightly indeed. Carriage is an air of pert pretension and underbred finery. And even I don't call him that. 바로 뒷담화를 시전하지만 차마 그 이야기는 할수 없었죠. I brought you a book from the Donwell Library. Box Hill. I hear you can see for miles. There is no reason you shouldn't see for yourself. 하이버리 밖으로 나가 본 적이 없는 엠마에게 새로운 희망 그리고 군 뉴스가 찾아오죠. This Mrs. Churchill has taken a house in Richmond. For her health, you will be dancing again before long, Miss Woodhouse. We shall have our ball after all. Frank may now come and go as he pleases. His aunt cannot keep him from us. 드디어 손꼽아 기다리던 무도회 날. 춤을 출수 있다는 사실보다 그녀를 더욱 떨리게 하는 건. Is he still in love with me? Is Mrs. Elton here? I have a great curiosity to meet her. He is not still in love with me. Ladies and gentlemen, the town square. 다행히도 첫 파트너란 사실은 잊지 않았고. She and Mr. Churchill are made for each other. I see you are watching Miss Fairfax. Have you picked up any clues as to her mystery? No, I was merely thinking how awful her hair looks. That's so unbecoming. 두 번째 타임이 시작되자. Oh no, Mr. E, I'm setting this one out. Do you not dance, Mr. Elton? I see a young lady who I should very much like to see dancing. 난감한 상황이 벌어지고 이 상황을 묵묵히 지켜보던 이가 있었죠. Thank you. Your secret is out. The littleness about him which you saw. And I did not. I was convinced he was in love with Harriet. Could I have been so stupid? 그도 지난 날 발언을 사과하며 오해는 눈녹듯 사라지는데. Where you dance, dear Emma? If Harriet were about to fall in love for the third time this year, 금사빠 해리의 엠마의 예상대로 새로운 사랑이 찾아왔다 고백을 하게 되는데. 
prefer, and remember, my matchmaking days are strictly over. No names shall pass between us, and there will be no possibility of a mistake this time. 해리의 시 사랑에 빠져서 일까? 그동안 해본 적 없는 고민이 들어가기 시작하고. Do you think it's strange that I, her only sister, did not go to London for any of their births? 아버지를 곁에서 지켜야 한다는 강박의 발이 묶여 집 밖을 떠나본 적이 없는 엠마. 이런 자신을 이상하게 보는 사람들의 편견을 깨뜨리고 싶었던 걸까? Box Hill. It will be a very small and intimate party. Well, I will arrange everything. I'm so experienced in organizing the carriages. Leave the whole expedition in. 엘턴 부부가 동행한다는 사실이 싫었던 엠마. 게다가. Mrs. Elton's carriage horse is injured, which means we all cannot go to Box Hill. We are only to postpone. In the meantime, why didn't you all come to Donwell? 급 계획을 바꿔 분열 나들이가 시작됐지만 날씨가 최악이었고. Well, I think Miss Fairfax needs a rest. We all need to relax with a simple game. How exciting! I do love a good game of alphabet squares. 게임이 시작되고 얼마 지나지 않아. What the great amusement, or rather the poignant sting of the last word, Dixon? It is more that Miss Fairfax has an admirer, and Frank and I are trying to work out who it is. 이 사실이 궁금했던 것, 프랭크와 제인 사이에 무언가 있다는 생각 때문이었습니다. 하지만 엠마는 똥초기라며 무시해 버리죠. And I can vouch for his indifference to Miss Fairfax. Believe me. Yes, these are the finest beds I've seen. 모두들 딸기에. 환장하는 사이. Oh, Miss Woodhouse. So kind. When it is noticed, I am not here. Could you say I have gone home? Let me call the carriage. I would rather walk. 그렇지만 정상이 아닌 듯했는데. We all know what it is to be weary in spirit. The greatest kindness you could do me would be to let me go. 그렇게 말도 안 되는 거리를 걸어서 가게 되고, 그리고 꿈에 그리던 복스의 나들이를 떠나는 날. 오늘도 날씨가 도와주지 않았죠. They look as though they would rather have stayed at home. 나들이를 포기한 채 수다 삼매경이 시작되고. Now she requires either one thing very clever, be it prose or verse, two things moderately clever, or three things very dull indeed. 수다쟁이 베이트 양이 자신감을 드러내지만. Oh, but there is a difficulty. You will be limited as to number. Only three at once. I will try and hold my tongue. I must be very disagreeable today. We walk. 사이진 분위기에 사람들이 자리를 뜨기 시작하자 기다렸다는 듯. They were lucky to find each other. To think they only had a few weeks' acquaintance in a public place. How many a man has committed himself on short acquaintance and regretted it for the rest of his life? Maybe only weak characters who are determined they will be unhappy forever. Just. 오랫동안 알고 지낸 엠마야말로 그에게 딱 맞는 여자라는 듯한 말투와 행동. 이가 상해 버린 나머지 일행들 모두 자리를 떠버리고 잠시 후. Emma, I cannot see you behaving so without speaking my mind. Badly done, Emma. 베이트 양에 대한 무례함을 지적하자 사실인 걸 어쩌냐며 모르쇠를 시전하는데. Resisted. And were she prosperous, were she a woman of fortune, I would allow you some liberties. B. She should attract your compassion, not your contempt. 이로써 두 번째 팩트 폭행. 멘탈이 완전히 탈려버렸고. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. I suppose you will be wanting to plan another trip soon. No. No, I don't think so. 충격이 제법 컸던 걸까? 며칠째 표정이 돌아오지 않았고. Miss Woodhouse, I'm so very sorry to. Kim has said she could not bear to see anyone. She is ill. I bought a basket at the picnic fair. 진심을 다해 사과를 전하고 돌아온 집에는. I am on my way to London. I'm glad Miss Bates liked the food. Goodbye. She says Mr. Knightley is not in good humor. 어째서일까? 런던으로 떠난 후 그의 빈자리가 더욱 크게 느껴지기 시작했고 얼마 지나지 않아. Mrs. Churchill is dead. Why should we care? John. Frank will be free. I am so very happy at this dreadful. No, the Westons have always intended Emma. People. 이렇게 모두들의 관심은 엠마와 프랭크에 집중되기 시작하고 며칠의 시간이 흐른 어느 날. What is it? 
Frank is engaged to Jane Fairfax. There has been a solemn engagement between them since October, since they were at Weymouth. I thought I knew him. This has hurt me deeply, Emma. But why did he come amongst us already engaged? And then pretend to be so very unengaged. 제인을 사랑했지만 이모의 반대에 부딪힌 프랭크. 유산을 놓칠 수 없었기에 뿐 많고 집안 좋은 엠마에게 접근을 했던 거였죠. No wonder she cannot stand the sight of me. With his aunt no longer opposed, he threw himself on Jane's kind. 두 사람은 관계를 회복하지만 신경 쓰이는 게 있었는데. I would have encouraged you to have. Feelings for Mr. Churchill. If I had the slightest suspicion, why should you worry about me? You cannot think that I think about Frank Churchill. Not so very long ago, when you had me believe you were a little interested, Frank Churchill, indeed. I hope I have better taste than to think of Frank Churchill. 다행이라 생각하는 것도 잠시. That you are talking of Mr. Knightley. To be sure, I perfectly remember the occasion. 집시로부터 구해준 사건이라 생각했던 순간이 사실 무도회에서 먼저 손을 내밀어준 나이트리 씨의 매너였던 거죠. 더 이상 간섭하지 않겠다 약속했기에 눈물이 맺히기 시작하고 뒤늦게 떠난 버스를 향해 손을 흔드는 사이 나이트리 씨는 Frank Churchill and Jane Fairfax are engaged to be married and have been attached for several months. There you are. I thought you had a look about you to scold me as you used to. Oh. Time, Emma. We'll heal the wound. Please believe me when I say that I have no other reason to regret I did not know their secret end. I. 프랭크의 속도 모르고 이용당한 내 자신이 바보 같았던 엠마는. Can I must tell you. No, please don't tell me. 또 다시 팩트 폭행을 당할 자신이 없었습니다. 하지만. Wait, wait, please stop. We are old friends. I will hear anything you want. Friends indeed. Have I no chance of succeeding? My dearest Emma, if I loved you less, I might be able to talk about it more. <laughs> I do not know what to think. <laughs> 그렇지만 다음 날 도련 파혼 선언을 해버리는데. Emma, you must know I could never leave him. He could not bear it, and I will not do it. As I said, as I said, I will move to Hartfield for as long as necessary. 새뿔도 단김에 빼렸다고 아버지를 찾아뵈는 두 사람 그리고 또 다른 해피 엔딩. I, Harriet Smith, take the Robert Martin. 초심으로 돌아가 사랑의 결실을 맺게 되고 마침내. It's the time. Yes. It's an eternity. You still don't know where you're going. It's a surprise. The seaside. Jane Austen이 너무 사랑했지만 당시 시대상과 맞지 않아서일까. 나 자신만 사랑할 수 있다 말한 캐릭터 엠마 그녀가 바랐던 삶이 녹아들어간 작품 엠마였습니다.